Hello everybody, and welcome back to Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Last time, uh, we dealt with Drahomir, and it was really stressful and confusing and a shit show. And to be honest, I, I looked it up, and there's basically two ways to deal with him. You send the cops in, they kill him, you don't kill him. Or you knock him out, and it kind of doesn't resolve the issue? Or you kill him yourself. So, yeah. I don't know, I just sent the cops in to deal with him. After that, I reloaded and dealt with it that way. Disney could use some help. And we got some different upgrades since then. I went around and I've been dealing with some extra in-between stuff. We got the Cassia. So, I... It should work on this? It didn't work on Drahomir. Didn't work on the police officer. It... Disney could use some help. It's really confusing. It's not very clear what it works on either. So, we're gonna have to go through this again. And hopefully Cassie will work. Spoiler, if we're loading the game up here, I kinda know it well. Come closer. Let me see you. There's nothing to be scared of. Everyone's worst impulses get checked at the door. Yours included. I hope you understand the need for it. So if it will work, we you'll be in the top left. We pacifism here. Alternatives to terror. Don't want animals dragging in the mud. Who are you? What? What? What is all this? This... This is oh, okay. what the new freedom looks like. Still Alpha A Omega. A collaborative elaboration beta. of the imaginative experience. Experiments of some kind. We're beyond experiments. We're establishing truths, new models of belonging and community, ones in which people can actually live. Your own little utopia. There's a man outside who. He asked, he asked me to come. He said you. A man outside. I know what it's like outside, trapped between acts of humiliation and acts of terror, between resolutions and registry codes, the canned laughter. The scripted dreams. It's no longer a place for people. I came because I thought something was... It... It's wrong. I had reason to believe something's wrong. Everything is wrong. That's why we're here. Bracketing out the terrors. If only in this one tiny corner of the world. Allow me to suggest something. A version of you. A version that strips away all suspicions, free of the sinister cells we cling to along the way. Here, you can be free of the injustices, the suffering, your own animal impulses. Finally, you can be human. Benevolent, optimistic, pacifistic. Richard is a great man. His words are an extension of his benevolence. His presence... An antidote to fear. Somehow he has created a space free of aggression and violence. From despair. The despair to please him is overwhelming. Richard is a great man. The desire to please him. <sighs> See, Cassia's... So it's saying... I guess it's... no? Omega? I guess? So if I don't select anything, it goes down. If I select Alpha or Beta, it goes down. Select Alpha, it stays about the same. Select Omega, it goes up. This is very not clear, to be honest. And during that whole time... Hmm. Hmm. 
45, 45, 45. Direct approach success. Hmm. Hmm. Let's try this challenge first. I may not know exactly what's going on here, but I do know that an honest man wouldn't need to hide behind a screen. I know what you're thinking. You can't wait to be the best version of yourself. Negative? I don't know for a fact that you're doing anything wrong. That's because I'm not. Unless you count saving these people. So the bait response he didn't interrupt. Repression. Exile. The Restoration Act is the single greatest human rights violation of all time. These people deserve better than that. See, Cassie's not helping too much here now. Claim to be saviors, they... You have a skeptical personality. It's understandable. You're a product of your time. No one's forcing you to stay. See, they're all lighting up. That's the thing that's confusing me. You, you want me to leave? What business? I want you to understand. The people who choose to be here, they are good people. And with my help, they have done something miraculous. They have found a better version of themselves, of society. Promise me you won't jeopardize that. So this would be the alpha response and the beta. I didn't come here to jeopardize these people. That's good enough. That's all I need to hear. And that's that. Hmm. The skeptic. All he sees is Stuart. And that's that. And he just ignores me. Right, and I can't use my eyes here. That's another downside. But I get some wine. <sighs> well, shit. Oh, Secretary from 4. Well, that didn't really tell me anything new. Well, I guess we'll just collect these and then leave. Can I take that book? No, of course not. You didn't have anything, right? I can hear his voice inside of me, even when he doesn't speak. Yeah, I don't know. I tried. Discard the darkness. Hmm. your sinister thoughts. Suppress the memories of what happened to you. Can I? Oh, yeah, there's that. Embrace our new life um, what other things? We got some emails to go through. Ah, which I shouldn't have picked up these ones. Oh. Two emails I have to ignore. That's all. Anything in here? No. Okay. Alright, let's leave. And when I leave, that clears up. Business. Nick could use some help. You got anything new? Oh, I can still hear it. It's like a mosquito in my brain. Hmm. Okay, well, I gave it a try, Viznik, but that is not very clear, to be honest. Maybe go with double beta response? I don't know. I don't want to look it up further, because that ruins the point of it. Um, let's see, we'll go up this way. So yeah, I had the cops deal with Jahumir, they killed him. I, To be honest, both situations didn't sit right with me. Having them kill him or going to knock him out and then all the cops in the city were pissed off. By the way, if you do it the way I did it, no matter what, any time a cop sees you, regardless of being on alert or not, they will flip the fuck out and alert every single police officer in the city. 
So, safe to say, the way I did it is very, very, very wrong. Because right here, boom, alert, and everybody starts shooting at me. Right here, just boom, no reason. Um, one of the police officers died. That kind of sucks. I don't think it was the lady that we had, which was her. You have to stand and, oh, and she's all cleared up. She was missing an eye and an ear. She got a bullet right in her eye and uh, one in her ear. But yeah, that's all cleared up now. I didn't really like either way of doing it, to be honest. They both really sucked, and dealing with it really sucked. But... Uh, I don't know. Both, both situations are shit. Pacifist ways to kill him with the police, apparently? And... Uh, it, it just still doesn't feel right. Doesn't seem like the pacifist way. Because the pacifist way is like... Not killing anyone by any means, you know. Oh, I should have took the other train. So if you go through the um the natural train, when you get off, the police officers are like, "Hey, you can't be doing that. You're an og." And then they ask for your papers, and that's that. Just a quirky little thing. All right, this will take a while, so I'll cut I'll cut all the trains out in the future. Just so you know. Nice guy, Jensen has arrived. Yeah, his face looks so good. I mean, graphics-wise, of course, you know. Alright. So we got this book here. I don't know if I've read this before. Let's see. The social monitor? Nope, I haven't. So we got a couple books and a couple emails to go through. And I would like to deal with this one and just get the golden ticket out of the way. So, we'll be doing that for today. The Social Monitor, The Shame of Aw Ghettos. By virtue of social and legal pressures, many large cities, especially in the Western world, have undergone a transformation in the last two years. Willingly or not, the augmented population in each of these cities has been corralled into specific neighborhoods. Restricted and segregated, originally marketed as specialized living for the enhanced, these districts quickly became something else. Under er, underserviced, inadequate housing only meant to keep conflict and contemption between the augmented and the normal population. Right, wrong stick. It didn't take long for these communities to earn less and less flattering names from the surrounding communities, Tin Town, Golem City, the Rust Belt. It took even less time for these areas to become enclaves, often armed, that even the local law enforcement's avoided, at least without sufficient backup. And we have two books to read, which should be the next three decades, Fall of an Empire. For the last 250 years, the United States of America has flourished, often growing by leaps and bounds, sometimes at a more leisurely pace. In a finite world, the growth may ultimately lead to its demise. Bloated government, bloated population, bloated populace, whispers of discontent with the federal government and its power over consuet states. Displacent er, discrepancies in interpretation of the Constitution and continuing struggles in the global marketplace against the economic power of the Chinese bloc. Well, until we got to the Chinese bloc, there it sounded like the current world status. All of these have led to a crisis. A, cr a crisis point. The next three decades will not see the complete dissolution of the United States. But there are strong wind brains that some states will succeed from the Union. Already Miltes have established footholds in state and local government in the Northwest states, as well as Nevada, Arizona, and Texas. It seems likely that this is the last grasp of a dying empire and that a second United or a second American Civil War could just be around the corner. Real talk. And then we have, let's see, probably not that, yeah, from Jahmir Kaneki, or from Franz to Jahmir. Our little forgery snuck out through the vents again last night. I know you think she is too scared to stay away for good, but she will always come crawling back out of fear, but still, without her, or 
Without her, our forgery ring is nothing. I understand how much you hate the idea of making structural changes to your mother's old building, but keep in mind that Koniki and Hiraki Tori Toy wasn't built to sustain our kind of operation. We need to do more to keep Melina inside and to keep everyone else out. From Andres. Um, no, from Shaznobog to Andres. The chemists were right. Neon is fatal to anyone who has neuropazine in their system. Oh, shit. Witness Exhibit A. Do whatever you have to get this body out of sight. Bury it, burn it, stuff it in a wall, which is where I found this one. I don't care. Just get rid of it. And keep this information to yourself. We want Neon to have a good reputation with the kids. Neon is color. Neon is hope. Potentially fatal is not the best selling point. She has no borg. Interesting. So is that... Yeah, that was definitely something for a quest, at least, that we learned. We have Alex the cat. Can't get in the server room. Cat maintenance said a burst pipe has messed up the panel, providing power to the door, but they can't fix it until tomorrow. It's switched off for now because it has electrical stuff around it. Looks scary as hell when it was on. Either way, door isn't opening until it's repaired, so you should come over yourself to make sure they're on it. For now, just give it permission to patch me remote access. Password is Messiah43. I'd rather be out of the station anyway with the, all the extra police hanging around. And shipment probs from Pavel to Teresa. Uh, Teresa, Manny is really nervous about the latest shipment and starting to say he wants out. There's not a lot I can say to make him feel better unless you got unless you go back to the usual schedule. The handlers at the Utilec warehouse are used to seeing the driver's roasters and I'm worried about the lads going to fold if they start asking too many questions. I know you think the medicine and stuff is important but I don't want to lose him or his job or worse because he makes because of me helping you. If you really can't wait until the usual then you're welcome to move the stuff yourself. It's all in the basement, the Diataga is normal, 5622. We'll get you inside if I'm not around. Any advice? Sit, wait, and don't fuck up the good thing, Pavel. Okay. And there's none I missed? Ah, oh, this... I missed this one. Paulina, go to the sewers behind the port district, tell Jectina what I've said, and she'll show you how to get in. Don't talk to anyone else about the... Okay, we've read that. And this one, trust. I keep hearing rumors and something is wrong. Someone's dealing Neon behind our backs. Do you think it could be Ivan? I never trusted this guy. I changed the password on our computer just in case. The password is Joe Branach. So, also, I figured out that you can use passwords in uh, computers and terminals and all that crap. And it actually will give you um, XP, unlike the old way, where you put in X you put in the password, and it would give you a tiny bit of XP. It actually gives you a good about a good amount, if not more, than hacking it. I think it honestly gives you more. So, yeah, our hacking days might be over, and we might actually be searching for passwords in the future. Also, this entire place was filled with gas. So I had to run down the um, the ladder thing, and then just run in here until I could find that. It only costs like two pain pills, I want to say, for us to get that. But yeah, that wasn't too bad. Like gas in this game, it's whatever. In Deus Ex: Human Revolution, though, holy shit, you can take two feet in that stuff without dying. And to be honest, it's like two praxis, right, for the uh, upgrade. Yeah, it's two Praxis and it drains a good amount of energy. No. Like, if it didn't drain any energy, worth it. If it drains energy, eh. It comes down to how much food and stuff I have to, to waste. Which, I have a lot of alcohol currently, so we are pretty good on that. And I saw this. Oh, but I can't move that. Maybe I can just... Meh. No. No, I can't. Uh, oh, yeah, and we have um, 
the og that lets us break through walls. So that's nice too. We still need to get this, which we will. Because that. What's the other one I really need? I think it's just that. And probably a couple augs for the eyes so that it takes less energy. It was kind of wasteful getting the one that lets me, um. Like, have more energy, but it's pretty nice because then I can just pop a bio cell, and bio cells are plentiful, so it's not that big a deal. I'm okay. Oh, yeah, if you walk up to these guys, their helmet's open. That's pretty cool, I think. So it's over here? Where over here? Because that's restricted. It's in there. Hey. Permit validation office is closed. It's always closed. You don't say. Well, you're gonna be a pain in my ass, aren't you? Are you going to be a problem? No. Sorry. Hmm. So it's up there? The checkpoint in an orderly fashion, please. I jump from there, right? Not much going on. Yeah. Hmm. Take out your paper. Oh. Hold Sorry. It, Clank. Let me see your permit and be quick about it. Yes, I'm yes. sure you'll find everything in order, officer. What's the matter, eh? I'm holding you up from some important uh, this is a, oh, this is a repeat. Okay. Is that what it is? Sounds impressive. God, their helmets are. Are you so going cool. to be a problem? Eyes to yourself. Hm. You are cleared through this checkpoint. Go about your business. Man, if I could get one of those helmets for a cosplay, that'd be sweet. Not problem, though. Well, I wanted to go in here, actually. Thank you. Oh, this is the actual way we go. We came in, right? Ebook over there? No. Wait. Yeah. Okay. So, this, so I'd have to go through that anyway. Okay. Um. Hmm. Screw yourself, guy. That's useless data. Damn. So the only alternative is in here. I went through some of these back sideways and there wasn't really anything of interest. There's no vents. Shit. No. If there was a vent here I could get in that way, but can't break that. Some of those vents in like little um Yeah. I already went through that, right? Yeah, okay. Some of these like little vents and like air duct things you can actually smash in. Which is pretty nice because it opens up other little shortcuts. I always get a little nervous. Hmm. So it's in there. Door's open now. Ah, oh, that's restricted. Hmm. Shit. Well, this could be very much a shit show. Come in here. Oh, you don't want to come in here? Okay. That's gonna be a problem. Oh, but this is the security terminal. Oh, but I do have to hack it. Alright. Anything? No? 
Alright. That sucks. Access granted. Alright. And just like that. Permit. Station deactivated. Ah, okay. And just like that. Okay. Well, I got into the ARC permit registry. Um, Hold on. That should give me access now as um, well. Why um, am I seeing a security timer? Probably because neither of us have done this before. Shit. Cross your fingers. I borrowed this employee ID from a guy in a bar. Did it work? Oh, fuck. Why does it say there's only one validation slot? Shit, shit, shit! The city has quotas for this kind of thing. Frag is designed to regulate people to death. What does that mean? The Hurry system up. won't let this guy register two people. Just scan something. There isn't much time. Help one person at least. Um, fuck. About it, uh, Arenka. Good. Arenka's documents should hold up to any kind of scanning check now. She's as legit as she can be. Without actually being legit. I came here to help two people. It doesn't always work that way. <sighs> Look, you need to get out of there. Please. No. We came in to help uh, two people. That permit I wasn't able to scan. What happens to Edward now? He probably fucked. ends up in Golem. Or he gets arrested for trying to use fake documentation. Thrown into a cell somewhere. I don't know. Doesn't exactly feel like a win, does it? No, no it, doesn't. it doesn't. We did the best we could. Listen, thanks for being one of the good guys. Doesn't feel very good. I want to beat the fuck out of that guy to get through his frustration. Let's hope I can take him out. Oh, I got him in here. Great. That's even better. Thank you. I got his code. Please, let me help Edward. Permit validation. Stations are accessed by government officials. Representatives only. It's for them valid at permanent people's permits. Not for citizens to do it themselves. If you ever have to disable the security system, maintenance. The maintenance code. Not what I needed. Same as the dog. Fucking... Sorry, guy. You're free XP. It's always nice. Do you even have a gun? Well, you have a drawer. You have pistol bullets. If you don't have a gun, you suck. There you go. Anything else in here of interest? Doesn't look like it. Well, that would have been useful. There's nothing else in there. That doesn't feel like a win. I chose Renka because she's young and vulnerable and she's already in a really shitty position. And... Like, she's already going through enough shit. Edward, Edward deserved it just as much as she did, but... Edward's an old dog, and... And, you know, he's had a good life. He has his family, but he's, he's living on those years. Arena, she's still young. I wanted to give her some hope and a chance. And it doesn't mean Jack fucked all now, really. So I'll take some beers. Where's the other beer? I saw three. Oh, they already picked up all three. Oh, shit. Well, let's put shrimp on the Barbie. There we go. Um, keypad? No code. God, it's like so useful to actually get the codes now. That's the shitty part. Cause like, it gives you a shit ton of XP. I see that vent there. So what are those? What are those? 
They're like literally right there. Hmm. Alright. Also, I know you can break down weapons later. I'm still selling them for the time being because we need the money for like praxises and stuff. And that's it. I don't really need bio cells because I can make bio cells now. Which is so fucking nice. Like, to be able to actually make energy. I, I just can't get over how useful that is. This is a nice town. I really like it. It would be really nice if we will not forget the lives lost during the Aug incident, 2027. Please, Justina Filia. Augurite is no different from gay rights, women's rights, or any other kind. We have to wake people up, shake them out of their indifference. I agree with everything you are saying, but believe it or not, mm, I no have but. other priorities in my life. I, want that I work in a soup kitchen twice a month. I collect them. No buts. Keep moving. No buts. You can open these and just run away really quickly. But. Police officers? Yeah. Hmm. And that was that for here? Anything else I need to do here? Well, we got the one AUG. Um. And it's just one, right? All right, let's get that. Now, nice guy Jensen is freaking fit. Can I sneak through here? Nice guy Jensen's fit, but not lean. He is a mean augmentation machine, but he is a little bulky. Oh well, he can't have everything. And that's fine, because Jensen's freaking fit as fuck. It's over here. So we should be able to move this thing. Not come soon enough. And then... Check over there? Funny. Where the fuck was it? Is it over here? How did I get over here? Wasn't it over here? I don't remember that music. Yeah, it's right here. Frickin' fit! Yeah! Oh shit. That also alerts people. I forgot to mention that. Um, shit. Now electricity still hurts like a bitch. So let's see. And to be quite honest, dealing with frickin' boxes and box physics and the jump physics in this game is AIDS. Like, pure horrible. So, well, it doesn't take energy. If it does, it takes such a little... Yeah, it doesn't take energy. Or I wouldn't be able to reach in. Okay. Oh, that was... Alright. Nice thing, though. I can access the letter from both sides, I think. And it just puts me on the right side. So there's this. Oh, but this actually needs a key card. Rave party key card. Can I just bust out the wall? No? Okay. So that's how I get in there. Let's see, any other... So are there any other here? Let's see, where are we? We are at... Fuck if I know. Will this tell me? No. But that's useful. The calibrator. And I'm here. Okay. Alright, let's check that out real quick. Let's see if I can do these things. I can't do a whole lot, but at least... Where is that ray from here? Oh, you have a quite nice coat. And nice hair. Oh, nothing. I just complimented you. What's up there? So that'll probably take me up to there. Or there. What would take me up to there again? I don't know. Here we go. What's in here? Just make it through this shift. Hello. Whoop. Have a look around. Hello. Yeah, yeah, I know. You have no money. Whatever. Yeah, very pissed off there for a second. What about you? I'm in a hurry. Hmm, aren't we all? Hmm. Anything? This is 
I can take your printer and just leave. Oh, it's a very nice uh, cone you get here. Let me just... Alright. See ya. Jensen away! Into the vents. That's fucking pointless. Pointless as well. Mm. Bio cell thing, which would get me up there to there. What would that get me though? I don't know. What about in here? What's in here? I don't know if going through, like, past the doors and then unlocking the doors without actually using the terminal gets me XP as well. I'll have to test that out sometime. I doubt it will, to be honest, but it's always worth checking. And this is completely pointless. Hmm. You got anything? If you're hoping to buy something from me, you're out of luck. I kind of want to knock him out just for that. That's a big-ass cockroach. Some dead-as-fuck eyes. Alright. See ya. It's nice that there's these little vendor shops that are pointless as hell. And I honestly mean that because there used to just be, like, broken-down shops in Detroit and there was nothing there. Like, no real commerce or trade or anything like that. But now we actually have something. Some just minor theft, you know. Nothing to worry about. Yeah, not that one, though. No. Probably not this one either. Oh, no. Money, money. Alright. It's over there. Just got through another round of layoffs at the office. I think they cut the workforce by 25% in the I know it's restricted, but is that the upstairs that might be restricted? Maybe? Let's see. Because these civilians just walked in. Yeah. Hello. Wait, were you followed here? What? What do you mean? You can't be too careful. They have eyes everywhere. Is he supposed to have right. that? And I suppose you have all I need to make sure they uh, stay out of my business, right? You know. I do. But don't let the shop fool you. It is only a sideline. I merely sell parts, raw materials, you know, the, the sort of thing you can use to make something else. Okay, you're fine. Listen, you look familiar. Have we met before? Uh... No, I'm pretty sure I remember. I wouldn't. I get occasional memory loss. Ever since the incident. I got rid of my AUG right after that. Oh. Inner ear implant used to help me with my balance, but now I just hear ringing all the time. You hear that? Hear what? Never mind, anyway. Let's change the subject. You want some of those special ingredients I mentioned? Yes, yes. Oh. Well, I'll take sure, them. Sure, I'll take them. Now is Wait. that... You won't be disappointed. Multiple? I think I'll be on my way. Sure, sure. But uh, before you go, you don't by any chance have any neuropazine you can spare, do you? Why? Or do you need it if you're not yeah. augmented anymore? Are my you... brain still thinks I am. Some joke, huh? So, uh, can you can you help me out? Yeah, I'll help you. Sure, here you go. Anything in it for me? Thanks. You're all right, you know that? A real friend. You should go down to my basement and have a look around. I've got some cool stuff down there. No well, thanks, buddy. Hey, and it's not restricted anymore. Sweet. I mean, I would still went down there and taking your stuff, but... It's always nice to have permission. Can I, out of Kyria... Oh, it's... I'm... He said it's cool, lady! Hey! The fuck? Get out of here! Don't do anything stupid. Come in, come in. Get the fuck out of here! 
We're buddies. He's cool with me. The fuck? We're cool. <sighs> Some fucking people. Oh shit, big boxes. Good thing I got that AUG for heavy lifting. Shit. Let me fuck it. Jensen, your shit's too big to get out of this hole. Oh, there we go. Alright. Whew. It's good to say. Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. What's all this shit? Sensors. Parts. I'm okay with getting rid of some neuropazine by helping people. I, do I know it sells for a thousand. I don't give a fuck. Terrorist bomb Razuk train station Prague top story, a serial or series of coordinated bomb blasts tore through Razuk station yesterday morning, killing dozens of travelers and renewing fear of large-scale terrorist mayhem against the city. Rail travel to Prague is being rerouted while forensic investigators comb the debris of the air for answers. The mor this morning is remained unclear who is responsible, but given that two similar bombing targeted lawmakers and destroyed a police precinct earlier in the year, this attack suggests that the augment augmented terrorists. Of course it suggests that. Upset over Prague's model augmentation license and right relocation programs may be responsible. Obviously, the world is watching Prague. State police spokesman Alekchev Volner told reporters, and that is why we are working hard to bring the wave of augmented terror to an end. Even with Interpol aiding in an investigation, I'm confident that our people can bring swift justice to those responsible. Hackers published stolen emails in Washington, D.C. Interesting. Claiming to have proof that the International Mon Monetary Fund holds the poorest countries in the economic gun pool on behalf of the world's elite, Juggernaut Collective hackers released dozens of emails stolen during last month's cyber attacks. Many of the emails were read, however, seem to be reminders to keep staff refrigerators clean. Interesting. Papa Cola soft drink? Yes. We have this. Did you give me the code? You didn't give me the code. You suck. And that was through there. Well. Don't mind if I do. No reason to? Ah, I'm just still gonna do it. People might run downstairs. Yeah, that might have happened. I figured. It's fine. It's fine, because I get to punch through a freaking wall like a badass. And that's that. There's nothing else hidden behind these crates. Just this vent and that that I can't get to yet. We only got level hacking 2, or hacking level 2. We could have got level 3, but I'd rather lift big shit and be fit Jensen. Fit nice guy Jensen. Ah, so this leads here. It's there, it's there. Hmm. Breaker's not over here. And I'd have to jump onto that to that. Um... I'd rather not like to die just yet. If we can avoid dying in a single episode, that'd be nice. In off camera, I'm fine with it. On camera, waste of time. I'm fine with wasting my own time. Wasting all of your time though? Nah, I don't want to do that. Avoid that as much as possible. As he proceeds to read the same book probably two to three times. Hmm. I'm sure it's fine. Anything else in here? Ah. Don't mind if I do. What could possibly go wrong from busting through the walls? It's more of these 
wines that it can't take. Hmm. Anything else in there? No! I want that. This is safe and probably fine. I will leave you guys here because the end of the episode is once again ending and searching for me because I did nothing wrong. Definitely not stealing and not breaking through walls and taking stuff that was totally mine. Speaking of my email, let's see what my email was. From Ferdinand Ferdinand to Alma. Yeah, an old woman with a cut cat uh, Yeah, an old woman with a Cadillac on each foot and her own business. It's a hell of a lot more than I got. Alma, my heart's boot my heart bleeds. As a matter of fact, I did something that I wanted to follow up on. I did wait. But I wanted to follow up on it before I get back to you. But well, you don't want to walk into a place like Palestad Bank looking the way I do. Sames 6641 is a code to the safe in the bank. It's in room B, row 1. I'm guessing that's where your inheritance is. Well, it had to be. After digging my way, my way through old granny's box of musty old shit for three days and choking on dust from the 20th century, I'd say I'm ready for my 15%. Please, no need to thank me. Your charitable smile is more than enough to get me by until the check arrives. Received email. Hmm. Fern, any luck tracing the number my grandmother left me in her will? What's taking so long? Even in death, what that cursed woman continues to torment me with her stupid games. Why couldn't, can't the old bag just leave me money like a normal person? I'll be an old woman myself at this rate. Interesting. Alright. Well. We got another code. And I get to go through more shit. Oh. Well, I'll figure out a way to get out of here without getting into too much trouble. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next episode. And I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. And I hope you guys have a lovely day. See you later.